Spiritual marketing, the alchemy of the secret Jedi nation. Have you ever met one of those chiropractors who never seems to leave the friggin' practice, doesn't know what the heck Facebook even is, let alone making meaningful posts? They, they think the idea of a, of a Google uh, review is to actually sit down with their phone and flip through and like, you know, search Google or something like that. Have you ever met one of these people? Man, aren't they kind of crazy? How is it they do this? Well, I'll tell you something. I gave the secret handshake and entered the lair of one of these crazy Jedi chiropractor marketers recently and what I learned will blow you away and might actually expand your ability to run the practice of your dreams. Stay tuned. Jedi trick number one. Ki Gon Jin said, your focus determines your reality. And I can tell you this was definitely true in the presence of this chiropractor. His presence was, was soothing, but like disarmingly almost frightening because he was so present, completely focused. It didn't matter what it was we talked about. He was completely present time conscious and completely focused. This is in stark contrast to many of the chiropractors I've interacted with in my life who are jumping from this thing to that thing to this, you know, great idea to this technique to this idea instead of staying laser beam focused on what it is that they do really well. It's the epitome of the law of attraction at work key is to focus in and be laser beam focused on what it is you do and on your key product and service which is detecting and diagnosing interference nerve interference subluxations whatever it is you call it and then clearing that out be a laser beam focus because that determines your reality jedi trick number two there is no try right this is the famous yoda quote it actually says try not do or do not there is no try and I can tell you something that this chiropractor was not trying to be successful. He was being successful and he had an amazingly legendary practice, one of the biggest in the world for many, 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 many years, right? There was no trying to be successful. He was focused on results. He knew that if he got stellar results with each and every client that they would stay, they would pay and they would refer. It was such a simple construct, but it just seems to elude people. They're always looking for the next new magical social media trick or whatever, right? He also customized each and every treatment program. There was no cookie cutter BS here. And if his plan wasn't working, he had the parameters and benchmarks in place to know that and then make the changes. He got stellar results because he did not try. He was. I mean, let's face it, you guys. Why don't you just go and try and sit down right now? I mean, I mean no, seriously, go try and sit down. You, can, you either sit down or you don't. There is no try. Obi-Wan Kenobi said, in my experience, there's no such thing as luck. Jedi trick number three. It's not really a trick. It's just like luck. There is no such thing as luck, right? Luck is something that you make. Luck is when preparation meets opportunity, my old high school uh, coach used to say right? And so there's no luck to be in a successful doc. There's no luck to be in a successful chiropractor. There's no luck to be in a successful business person or a successful parent or raising great kids. It's about focus. It's about intention and it's about hard work when it needs to be done hard and getting the results that you know need to be got. No excuses. Winners always find a way to win. Luminous beings are we, not this crude matter. Yoda said. Here's number four for you folks, right? Every Jedi chiropractor I've ever met had the great understanding that there's more to it than this just crude matter, that we are truly luminous beings. And they invested time, energy, and occasionally money to become more luminous. They're deeply grounded spiritual people. They take part in things like retreats. They take part in things like meditation and journaling. They do things to really focus on what it is at the essence of who we are as luminous beings and don't get caught up in just the physical flesh and blood. They bring it into their personal lives and just as importantly, they bring it into their practice and bring that energy, that vital life force energy into their practice with their practice members. Just like every other successful person I've ever spent time with or studied, these Jedi chiropractors are just a pleasure to be around. They come from a grounded, centered place of certainty. And you just leave their presence feeling more lit up as a result of that. So their marketing secret gang is not what they do, but it's who they are and how they carry themselves in the world. People just flock to them because they want to be around them. There's a healing consciousness. There's a sense of groundedness. There's a sense of certainty. There's a sense of leaving that place a more complete human being than when you join them. 
So my challenge to you now today is to think of what you could do to become more grounded, what you could do to become more certain, what anchors, what rituals, what things could you bring into your life in the next week to make you more luminous, more centered and more grounded because that will enhance your marketing message regardless of what it is that it is you're doing. These people just go about quietly creating stellar results and people want to be in their presence. Again, this is Dr. Tom challenging you to be more so you can do more and have more of what your heart desires.